Hello friends and welcome to Escaping the Mouse with your host, me, Rick Roll. All right, it's the first day of my long weekend. I just got done doing my live stream and I've been hearing that there's a Comic-Con in town. Now, I went to a Comic-Con uh, last year as a guest of the people of Silent Screams and we had a lot of fun there. And this one's right here in, Tim, in town, so let's go check it out. This is gonna be good. All right, here we are at the Extraco Event Center, and every time I go to something like this, I always think of something that comedian Daniel Tosh said in a, in a sketch once. Uh, he said that one time, as a practical joke, he wanted to hire Donald Gibbs. Donald Gibbs was the guy who played Ogre in Revenge of the Nerds, and he wanted him to run into one of these places screaming, Nerds! Nerds! Just to see what happened. Apparently his producers wouldn't let him do it because he, they thought the uh, the reference was too obscure and nobody would understand what it was about. Wow, check this place out. It's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Let's just wander the aisles to see if we see anything interesting. So, as is often the case on these things, they have uh, some celebrity uh, guests. I gotta admit, I don't know who any of these people are, but that's okay. We'll just kind of take a while, a slow walk by here and you can see what you see. A lot of voice actors and stuff like that. That one I went to in Temple a few months ago, that had a couple of people there that I was at least aware of. Not so here. Some kind of cool 3D art of different comic covers and stuff like that. That's really kind of neat. If you wanted your own witch or warlock wand, I guess this is the place to go. Kind of some fun uh, artist renditions of classic film scenes. A lot of anime stuff here. I'm not really into that, but there are some cool stuff, so let's check it out. See what I mean about the anime? But then there's also a lot of just really talented artists that are showing their wares. How you doing? Good, how are you? I'm great. A lot of cool banners and Star, uh, Star Wars stuff. That's a Klingon symbol. Federation flag. I think that's Star Wars. Kind of fun stuff. A lot of cool collectibles, it dolls, and movies. Seem to go for the horror over here. That's cool. Oh, check that one out. Jordan would love that one. I'm only here to chew bubble gum and kick butt. We're all out of bubble gum. Wow, this one's like nerd heaven here. All the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles in the box. This wood booth, I don't know, is that wood cut or is it burned? Or, I don't know exactly what those are, but those are really cool looking. Got a whole bunch of them. Oh, and of course, you always gotta have a sword play. Holy cow, those things are sharp too. You know what I've been looking for? A Klingon Batleth. Haven't found one yet. Look at all these great t-shirts. Mars Attacks there. Another Texas Chainsaw Massacre shirt, that's what I need. Back to the Future DeLorean shirt. 
Stay, stay puff mar marshmallow man. And of course, you can't go to a Comic Con without seeing all sorts of comic books for sale. Check out these cool uh, mobile hanging terrariums. Yeah, if you're interested, check them out. Wow, check out all these Lego characters. Crazy. Is that Groot? I think that's Groot. Alright, all sorts of fake IDs you can get here. I am McLovin. <clears throat> Jurassic Park Raptor Handler, if you ever wanted to be that. More uh, blade work if you're into it. Made in China. And you never see one of these before. They brought in a skate truck and they set this whole area up and you can rent roller skates and roller skate around this area. Gotta say, that's a new one. I ain't seen that. But then again, last one I went had a petting zoo. So this is Texas. So those are always kind of fun. It's always a... Uh, also kind of fun to watch places like that and just kind of people watch because I mean you know all the cosplayers are coming out and they're dressed as their favorite characters and yeah I don't know I'm not one to go that far but these are still fun to look at and I hope you enjoyed this one too so I think that's all that I have for today thank you as always for watching and I'll see you next time on Escaping the Mouse good night <laughs>